We are moving on now to our morning business report. The Cherokee Nation says it's time for Jeep to stop using its name. And a Connecticut-based bank will soon have a new owner. Jane King is live this morning in New York with those stories and more. Good morning, Jane. Hi, Nicole and Wendell. Good morning to you. Well, m and Bank of Buffalo has agreed to buy People's United of Bridgeport. It's the headquarters there. Now, m and said that it will buy the $63 billion assets of People's United for about $7.6 billion in stock. It's expected to close later this year. The merger, which is the first for m and since it bought Hudson City Bank in November of 2015, would create a bank with 1,100 branches and it would have a footprint from Maine to Virginia. Well, the GameStop story isn't over yet. The stock surge yesterday as the Reddit leader known as Roaring Kitty says he's buying more. He was one of those that testified before Congress last week. The stock was up 13% yesterday. And the chief of the Cherokee Nation wants Jeep to stop using the tribe's name on SUVs. The company has used the Cherokee name for more than 45 years, including for two current SUVs. Now, Jeep said it is committed to a respectful and open dialogue with the Cherokee Nation. Well, big tech hit hard yesterday in the Nasdaq down two and a half percent. The Dow was a little bit higher. There was some buying of reopening stocks, kind of like cruise lines and airlines. Now today looks like we'll be back down again. It looks like tech may be uh, in for a rough start so far today as well. Live from New York, I'm Jane King. Back to you.